Hello Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly general reading for March 2020. Before I start, I'd like to thank everyone who have subscribed to my channel. Those of you who've liked, shared and commented. And those of you who would like to have a private reading with me, please do check my about page. All the information you need is there. I now have an ST shop as well. So I've added the link there to make it much easier for you if you want to book a reading. So, Leo, let's see what the universe has for you today or this month in March. So, Tariton Universe, please tell us what is coming for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs in the month of March was going to be in your first position. Okay. Wow, Leo, you've got your own card here. Strength. What is complementing or crossing Leo? Well, Queen of Cups. Right, so what's going to be the base for, or the foundation for Leo? Okay. I'll take both, okay? The King of Pentacles and the Six of Cups. What's going to be in the recent past for Leo? Okay, the Death card. So... What can be achieved? Wow. Ace of Wands. So you've got death. You've got a beginning here. Mm. Interesting. 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 So what is coming for Leo? Okay, Knight of Swords. Right. So how is Leo going to be as them? Okay. The Chariot. What is crossing? Sorry. What is affecting or influencing the environment for Leo? In March. Oh. Nine of Cups. Wow. I've been seeing Nine of Cups guy for quite a while. <laughs> it's nice to see him. So, what's the hopes and fears for Leo? Wow, Leo, you've got another card. This is transformation, this transformation, or rebirth, rebirth. That's good. So, what is the possible outcome for Leo? Okay, seven of pentacles. And the bottom of the deck is page of wands. Okay. Right. So, Leo, this is looking interesting, okay? Because in March, this is death. Looks like you have been able, or you are going to be able to come to a conclusion with something. Something that I feel that, looking at these cards here, this, this is your childhood, okay? This is possibly your mother. So I feel this is something that has something to do with your family, okay? Something that you, you have been emotionally attached to, something that needs to come to a conclusion you have been able to to do that or at least in march you will be seeing that because this is going to be in your recent past okay so it looks good okay right so here we are and 
this is the king of pentacles and this is the six of cups what i feel here as i feel like you are looking for stability and i feel you are more of the king of pentacles rather than it being someone else because that is your foundation here i feel you know you you want to in march what's going to be of importance to you is anything in your past you want to resolve it but also feel is connected with finances your finances is also got to do with you looking after yourself you shining bright because you here you are having the energy of taurus and an aries okay but this is something in your past that you want to um sort out also i feel here you need to nurture yourself leo you need to look after yourself okay you need to eat well you need to sleep well you need to allow your inner child yes to come out and play i feel like in march you don't really want to stress yourself too much you know i don't feel you you should well that is my opinion anyway whatever it is having this king of pentacles here especially i feel like you know you are going to be you are going to be in control of yourself but i feel the way you are going to be in control of yourself is to look after yourself the inner child that is there there is a child within you that needs the nurturing and you you have to be that nurturer to yourself okay that child that you are i feel that is why these two cards have come okay right so this is you and this is someone that is crossing you and again this is an emotional situation for some of you i feel is to is to do with your your mother or someone in your family that's a family a, a, a female figure okay and whatever the situation is you need to you know apply it delicately you need to be careful how you deal with this situation and they are crossing you and i feel you are going to um deal with this solution uh or sorry this this situation and find the the right solution okay i feel you are going to come to um amicable terms okay whatever it is that you know this person is crossing you i feel like here you are going to be more assertive you know that that is what this strength card is saying you need to be assertive you need to be firm you don't have to be uh, mean you don't have to be brutal um but i can see that having this strength card here you are going to deal with this situation in a more diplomatic way okay and also this is what is coming right this is certainly chaos this is also so something to do with some some practical matters that needs um attending to it could be document it could be anything but whether it's got to do with family or not it is coming and it has to be addressed quickly and directly and i feel this is this is more of an influence that is coming in for you okay and i still feel it's got something to do with your career okay sometime in march this this is going to happen and you will need to sort this issue out and whatever comes in you have to deal with it quickly and so i feel this is the only pressure 
that you might face um, sometime in March, but I, I feel like you will be able to, to sort it out. Because having this Ace of Wands here is something that can be achieved. A brand new start, a new, a new offer coming in for you. And I feel this is someone making you the offer. Because it's the right hand that is going to be given to you. It's not a left hand. So this is a career that is coming in for some of you. And for some of you, it's a new energy that you are going to embody. Because this is Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy that you are going to embody. So I feel this is something positive that is coming in for you. So it's good. Okay. As you, you are the chariot. Success, driven, determined. And what can I say? It's all looking good. You've got a lot of yellows here. Look. You go yellow. You go yellow. You go yellow. You got yellow. Yes. And I feel this is going to be a month where you use your creative energy very, very positively. Because this is what is affecting your, your environment. Okay. This is how you are going to be. And this is you. And this is what is affecting your environment. You're having your wish card. Look, creativity. Enterprising business opportunities okay so so leo this is very good okay i i i, I wouldn't be upset about it <laughs> yes some of you your status is changing this is you know the nine of cups you are getting what you want but you are going to do that through diplomacy you are going to achieve that through diplomacy so um it's all good Good, 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 good. And here, we've got the card of rebirth. The six of wands. Whether you're looking for a promotion, whatever you are looking for, I feel your career, and here I feel more to do with your career, because this, this is a Leo card. You are going to be, um... For some of you, you are going to be promoted. For some of you, you are going to um, see yourself on center stage. Um, center stage, that doesn't mean that you're going to be on camera or anything like that. Maybe some of you are going to be. However, for some of you, you are going to be of very important importance to the community, the business where you work, wherever you are in the community that you are, you are going to be of very much important and you're going to be on st center stage your presence is going to be noticed and appreciated that is how I'm, I'm seeing here because this is your hopes and fears so you are looking for like a bonus a race that is coming in for you okay this is what you're hoping for and here having the seven of pentacles as your outcome i feel here you'll be You'll be more assessing yourself. You know, you will be thinking, I've been working hard on this situation and I'm not going to let it go because I'm going to be the winner. Of course, you are going to be the winner. Okay? You are going to be the winner. So look at these that can be achieved with your possible outcome. So this is you in this situation. This is what can be achieved and this is your outcome. And sometimes I find that your outcome could be in, in it, all these things can happen in a week. It can happen in a few days or it can happen in the course of the month. Okay, so this is you. So overall, I like you to look at all the positive things that's going to happen. I don't think this is a bad situation. This is you. I feel you'll be assessing things. You'll be looking at your finances, looking at how to make things work better for you. But I feel in, in March, you are going to overcome a situation with family that is going to lead you to concentrate on your, on your career. That is how I'm seeing it here. You know, 
this guy has saved this much and he's got this for himself. This disposable income and this is what he's saving. Okay, this is something he's been working on for quite a long time. And I don't think you're going to let that go. Because let's not forget, you got your, your rebirth card here. You see, so this is good. Okay, this is good. I am very, very happy for you. And as we see, your the bottom of the deck is the page of wands, bringing good news. And yes, I, I feel your wands and pentacles and your cups have come in for you in March. Everything is working for you. So Leo, I will leave the reading here. I hope this has been insightful. I will see you next month or you'll see me next month.